Whoa. It is, what is it? Today is Monday, June 27th, and I really liked making that video last week about the um, grocery, uh, what, what, what should I call it? It's like a, I don't know, hold on. It's called uh, <laughs> meal planning, the meal planning video, or the grocery, like only going to the grocery one. So I thought I'd make another sort of video like that where you just kind of follow me throughout the week and I show you what I make and hopefully it gives you some good ideas on like meal planning or um, just even if you're in a rut on what to make for dinner and that sort of thing. So I planned on um, I planned on Sunday like what we we're going to do for dinner and uh, things have kind of already changed. So um, I'll just show you like what my week menu looks like and then what my grocery store or what my grocery little um, list looks like. So this is what I have for this week. Um, these are all kind of going to change, which just looks really basic. I'm thinking about coming up with a PDF on like a printout that I can print out each week uh, for meal planning so it looks nicer so it's not just on like lined paper um, and then I can just put it on the refrigerator or something and then start a new one on Sunday or Monday every week. For now this is what mine looks like. It is, um, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. So today or Monday is going to change because I have a barbecue tonight with for my friend Jessica's birthday and then I don't know if I'm going to change like this to Tuesday. I'm not sure yet. I haven't, obviously I haven't gone to the grocery store yet. Um, the reason why Friday is not planned out is because I'm going to be in Dallas this week for my best friend's wedding. Also, this week is kind of challenging because David leaves Wednesday and I'm not sure if he's going to be here for dinner or not. Like his flight leaves at, actually he's not going to be here for dinner because his flight leaves at like, I think 540 and therefore he has to get to the airport at like, what, 3 or something like that, 330. So, yeah, so... Wednesday, Thursday, I'm meals, I am have meals on my own, um, which usually means like leftovers or something pretty small and uh, I don't know, I don't know. So I'm still planning, I will fill you in when I figure it out. <laughs> this is the grocery list for the week, minus the dog bones, but coffee, olive oil, sloppy joes, I need all these good things. This week at Safeway for the grocery shopping. Thick and chunky. I'll go with the original. So I was gonna say pro tip, go to the grocery store Monday morning because no one's there, but everyone and their mom seemed to be at the grocery store this morning. So here are my groceries. I'm gonna do a little Safeway grocery haul this time. This time we did have to pick up some essentials like to pick up butter, but this was on sale. This was like $2, normally six bucks, so that was cool. Uh, we usually just like to have emergency cans of tuna um, around the house. Last week I forgot to pick this up, and so I bought it this week. This might be controversial, but um, last week I talked about how uh, one of the things that I learned was to write down throughout the week, like if you did want a certain dish um, or like something that you're craving to write down that dish for the next week. And so last week, for whatever reason, I was like, I really want a sloppy joe. I haven't ever made sloppy joes. So I thought this week would be a good week to do it. And I might invite my brother over because, I don't know, it's just one of those dishes that you can make a lot of for two people. It's like, it's a lot of food, so I would probably invite my brother over, but um, I just got this Hunt's Man Witch original sauce. I don't know how it is, but I will report back. I had to pick up bug spray. We don't have any, I figure it's just good to have. <laughs> uh, cilantro, Napa cabbage. I'm thinking about doing two dishes with this since it is a lot. I've never made cabbage rolls before, but I was like Googling what to do with leftover Napa cabbage because I'm going to make a Chinese chicken salad that I'm going to use this with um, and I think that we'll have plenty left over so one of the things that they recommended was to make cabbage rolls I don't know how that's going to go but we'll see so that's that's an option cucumber and also 
zucchini. I was going to buy asparagus, but it wasn't on sale. Zucchini was super on sale, so bought zucchini instead. And then, oops, green onion. These are our ride or die favorite chips in the entire world, or they're like cracker chip things. Potato, spinach and garlic, good things. The Everyone who we've ever had try them is like, what is this magic? Disclaimer, don't buy it if you are like worried about eating a whole box of something because this is going to go down in one sitting. These are our favorite. They're on sale, so I thought I'd pick them up. We don't have any crackers right now, so... That's how these came about. Turkey breast for David and his lunch. Plus I also got onion rolls, which I figure like he could take sandwiches in. I don't know. Those are my thoughts. Um, these are for the Sloppy Joes though. Ground turkey for the Sloppy Joes because I couldn't do ground beef. I don't know why. I don't know why. It's just, I feel like it tastes the same and I feel better after I eat it. Is that a thing? I don't know. But, um, yeah, I got ground turkey. Almost done. Um, we ran out of olive oil, and I I love the California olive oil brand. And it was on sale, but it was all out. So um, I thought I'd pick up a bigger bottle. Either I like World Market's olive oil or um, go to different Safeway sometime. But this, should, this will get us through plenty of time. So I figured I'd just pick up this, like, kind of mini, or it's not mini bottle, just, like, small bottle fruit um strawberries were 77 cents which is awesome and then for lunch today i am going to have an apple so i got two apples because sometimes it's just good to bring i am teaching this week so i usually like to have like something to go in the morning hence also i got bananas i got them this is like a little bit too green for me but i know i'm not gonna eat any today and they'll be perfect tomorrow and wednesday and thursday so that's all the food I got. I will report back. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Today, um, today I'm just making the coffee. And I'm going to introduce you to the cutest little girl. This is Renly. Oh, my knee just cracked, but we're watching her for um, a friend, and she's a labradoodle, and she's so sweet. This morning, I think I'm going to make oatmeal, and I think David's staying homesick today because he still doesn't feel good. Um, so yeah, that's that's the plan for today. I watch these two hooligans play. <laughs> I like her because like when you pet her, you can like scratch her and like this and no hair comes off because she's hypoallergenic. Oatmeal. Let's go for lunch today because they're running errands. Busco is 100% a guilty pleasure. Only $1.50 for a hot dog. Woo Lunch of champions. Hot dog with mustard, a little bit of onion, a little bit of relish, and then the key is to get the sauerkraut. Mmm, sloppy joes. I haven't had sloppy joes in so long. I don't know. morning happy Wednesday <laughs> puppies are playing outside I'm having oatmeal again this morning and I love to make it this unsweetened silk almond coconut blend just added in a little bit at the end it's so good it makes it like super creamy okay, so the same concoctions yesterday strawberries cheese seeds flax seeds um, honey and then almond butter and it is so delicious. I had to have it again today. 
lunch today is very basic. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, do you guys like this? But um, cottage cheese, and then turkey slices, hard boiled egg, and then this, uh, this plum that I got from Safeway. And it's pretty sour. It's But I like it. <laughs> and just like make your mouth water sour. Sometimes I like sour things. <laughs> On another note, our little friend, our little labradoodle friend Renly left today. So it's just Cooper and I and then David leaves tomorrow for a wedding in Denver. So it's going to be a little lonely household. Um, I think I'm going to go over to my mom's for dinner and bring that Chinese chicken salad that I had talked about making. I'm such a dummy. Ugh, I forgot to film what I uh, had for dinner, so I guess I'll just explain it. <laughs> um, David left for Colorado today, and it is... Um, David left for Colorado. It's storming outside. David left for Colorado today, so I was on uh, for dinner on my own, and I have the Chinese chicken salad, but... I'm going to save that to make tomorrow for my mom and I. And so I was out late and anyway, long story short, I decided to go over to my mom's house, my mom and dad's house for dinner. My dad's also out of town, so it was just my mom and I. And we ended up having avocado toast, which was delicious, with hard boiled egg. And then we also had um, caprese with the tomato, mozzarella, basil, the whole shindig. And now I'm just hanging out at home. Cooper's waiting for his dad out there, even though he's obviously not coming home. Watching Scandal, and that's the end of my night. So I will see you tomorrow. Good morning. Happy, what is it? Thursday. I'm here with Cooper. And whoop. And um, I'm having a banana this morning. Banana and almond butter this is real classy um and then i made tea because i usually make tea when david is not here because he's a big coffee drinker and so i drink tea when he's not here because i actually prefer it i don't know that's a weird thing to say but um yeah i mean it's like a our thing in the morning to make our coffee together and so i don't like to miss out on that whole Thing. So when he's not here, I make tea and um, I have like PG tips or some sort of English breakfast tea and then with milk and honey and yeah, that's that's my morning breakfast. I am at Whole Foods, where is it? Whole Foods for lunch today. I decided since I was out that I would just go to Whole Foods because we have nothing at our house for lunch. Nothing for a house for lunch that I wanted. <laughs> All right, miso soup and this fish roll from Sakura, and then water, all from Whole Foods, and it was let's see, 12:35. This is what the miso soup looks like. <laughs> 